Hey, hey guys. <clears throat> Hello. What's going on? What do you want? Do you want do you want real or fake? Real or Ooh. fake? Wait, wait, wait. Which one's the real and which one's the fake one? <laughs> All right, I'm going to guess that one you're on right now is the real one. Yes. Okay. So good. <laughs> Exciting month this month. We uh, we added uh, we actually uh, got Patina Acosta. Uh, we joined our team uh, from North Carolina. She's our uh, lead project manager here now at Hounder, and uh, we've been beyond excited to have her. And uh, she just you know hit the ground running, and we're just yeah. It, it, you know it's amazing when you surround yourself with a really you know, just incredible, awesome group of people. We did get a, we did get your, thanks for sending the answers to your, your question. Yeah. We'll eventually get that up on the blog. And I, I really liked the, um, your answer, especially to the, uh, like, what was the strangest way you got injured? It was something about you, you fell at a wedding at someone's, oh, yeah. at someone's wedding or something. Yeah, Ooh. it was very embarrassing. <laughs> What, what, what happened? What happened? You were walking or? Um, yeah. So we were, I was actually a bridesmaid and we, we all rented an Airbnb and I forgot there were stairs to get to the car. So I had to go down the stairs to get to the gravel to the car. Well, I'm, I have on like three inch heels, dress all dolled up, beautified and everything. And I'm stepping down forgetting that there's a stair and I just trip and somehow thank god I landed flat on my butt because if I had landed any other way I would have gotten hurt and all the like bridesmaids and what are the grooms what are they called like groomsmen or whatever all, yeah. all, all, all around watching like oh my gosh this girl just busted her ass <laughs> hey guys this is Joey digital marketing lead here at Hounder and we figured, you know, hey, let's give them an update on what's been going on on the other side of the agency. So on the digital marketing side of things in the month of May, you guys might have heard that we finished a big SEO project here in the month of April. But of course, we continue to report on that and seeing the uh, seeing any progress or any adjustments that need to be made. And with that being said, actually, the most recent month to month report that we gave Actually, we saw a 10% increase in organic sessions for them. And so again, as much as we want to be excited with these increases, uh, we do understand that SEO is a marathon. And so um, we'll take it as much as we can or as little as we can. We know that the important thing is that there is improvement over time. And with that being said, actually, uh, as much as we like to help our clients with digital marketing, with development, with design, anything like that, that has to do with anything digital, um, Hounder is still a business at the end of the day. And so here we are in uh, mid 2022, and we're looking to do more of those things actually for ourselves. And so we're building up our website, we're running some PPC campaigns, thinking of coming out with some more topic authority pages for the website and so be on the lookout for that and maybe hey uh we'll be able to see you more on that side of things as we continue to develop that content and maybe you know you'll pick up a couple of things from those uh posts that we'll be posting here in the near future so hey thanks guys have a good one until next time peace That's That's seeing one. Though, what is WandaVision? it's a good show it is it's basically the Scarlet Witch or whatever. I think. The show? 
it's it's on Disney Plus. It's, it's like, like a, a one series. Gosh. Gosh. Yeah. Oh, speaking of Disney, they are milking. The Obi One show just came out yes, yeah, that today. Was, yeah. Very excited. It's good. It's fun. Did you watch it already? Did you actually watch it already? Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. Did you I watch the barely? <laughs> I watched both of them. <laughs> you were in your, in your baby Yoda costume. Did you like? Did you hold your lightsaber? <laughs> There you go. Yeah. <laughs> See, he's he's been hiding all the nerd stuff like up in front of the camera. Dude, that's one of the nice stuff. lightsabers too. Hello, everyone. My name is Rashad Mamie, and I'm a developer here at Helmer. Uh, today, I'm here to talk to you about our development work with Grinnell College. So as a developer at Hounder, my job is to make the page design, uh, take the page design that's given to us by our graphic designer and break it down into functional components that can be used to build these student journeys. So to start off, if we're breaking it down by components, this would be an intro page with a, a home banner. Uh, now this home banner gets to showcase a few different things like the class year of the student, their name, along with this really awesome animation for Grinnell. Just showcasing some of the, the highlights of these awesome components. So starting in, we see that there's this navigation here to the side. Uh, this side ring is actually going to follow us the whole way through the page, and it's going to track our, our progress as we go along. And we're going to see that there's this really awesome component, but this is actually an iframe that we get to, to pass in through our, Drupal, uh, through our Drupal CMS and build out for our student. As we continue down here, we have another image model where, again, our navigation is keeping track of where we're going. So let's go ahead and click on one of these and we actually get to see that it's a carousel of images that we get to loop through. And it's really awesome because we can showcase a lot of different images and filter on page and uh, get to show off these uh, awesome student journeys. We check it out here. There's a lot of awesome things that these pages show off about students. And here we hit our ending page or end cap of a student journey. Um, And with this, we know that our journey has been completed because our trackers hit the end. Um, it's really awesome to have worked on these sites uh, using Drupal as a CMS. Uh, a lot of complicated components and different things that we had to work on, um, but it definitely was worthwhile and we really enjoyed working with Grinnell College. I can't tell you enough about how much we appreciate um, all the companies that put all of their um, trust in us and work together to make just some, uh, some of the neatest applications and products. Uh, as well as you know, websites and integrations, um, you know, and, and some at the highest availability, which is just incredible um, to see. And so we just want to thank you all for your continued trust in us. We love working with each and every one of you, and uh, you know we're continue you know excited for all the continued work that we do with you, and uh, you know to move the companies forward. Um, we truly, uh, you. Know, we truly just wake up in the morning, love what we do, love the people we work with, love the you know the clients we get to work with, and so um, yeah, excited for more. And so we're going to continue to keep doing that and uh, um, putting that foot on the gas pedal on our end. So uh, thank you for everything you all do, all the uh, the amazing relationships we have, and uh, excited for a continued wonderful 2022 as uh, we keep going, as we roll into almost getting close to the halfway point of this year, of this year, which is amazing. So thank you. Um, We appreciate you very much and uh, just excited for all the great work, doing the best work of our lives together. Thank you.